All right. What is up, everybody? Raging Monster. Welcome back to another video. So today we're playing Demogorgon in honor of the Stranger Things chapter, sadly being removed from DVD. And uh, yeah, bear with me. Uh, my controls are fucked up, I think. They sure are. Um, life of a Hagmane playing other killers, by the way. <laughs> I always have to rebind my fucking secondary power. Okay. So, um, news broke today about the unfortunate um, loss of the Demo or the Stranger Things chapter in DVD. Um, you will be able to keep your skins for Demogorgon, as well as Steve and Nancy, if you bought them before November 17th. Um, that is the end date for the Stranger Things chapter in Dead by Daylight. Um, so yeah, I figured because of that, in honor of Demogorgon and in honor of Demo Please, we are going to play some Demogorgon. And, uh, we found this mech, and yeah, we faked her out. That's really good. Titter. Good shit. So, uh... Yeah, I actually just bought all three of Demogorgon skins. Uh, I do have them prestiged as well. Um, so I'm pretty much set when it comes to Demogorgon. I still need to buy Steve and Nancy skins. Uh, and after that, um, yeah. You are really greedy. This Meg is very greedy. Nice dead hard. Also, uh, I just threw on some add-ons and said fuck it. Uh, I threw on the one that makes it so you break pallets faster. Um, I think the glasses is fucking OP as shit. Um, so there are some questions that haven't been answered by behavior yet. Uh, a perfect example is are they going to be buffing or nerfing Demogorgon in the future? That is still up in the air. <laughs> um, as well as... Um, the like Even on the, like, the simplest things like the forms icons, right? Um, they don't even know if they're gonna keep those. Uh, there's, there's a lot of unknowns at the moment. Also, I don't know how I missed him. There's, so, yeah, <laughs> um, this is a first in Dead by Daylight, and, uh, I've seen a lot of people saying that, um, this is, like, the beginning of the end and shit like that. Like, first of all, it's not. Netflix has wanted to make a game of their own for a long time. Um, it was just kind of a matter of time before this happened. Um, and it's unfortunate that it's happening now, but it is... <laughs> There's really nothing we can do in regards to it. Also, I'm seeing some people talking about wanting to boycott Netflix and shit. Don't do that. It's not going to change anything. It may suck that Netflix is taking the Hawkins map out of the game, which honestly, is is that even really a bad thing? Um, that map was fucking horrible for balance, so I... I <laughs> is it really a bad thing Hawkins is leaving? I don't know. I mean, it's an awful thing that, you know... Nobody, no new players will be able to get Demogorgon or Steve or Nancy. Um, and it sucks that their perks and shit are just going to be reskinned and... Yeah. <laughs> and the achievements and stuff will just be opened and... All, all that sucks, but... You know, it happens. And uh, the best thing we can do is just kind of, you know... You know, if you, if you enjoy the characters, buy the cosmetics... Um, buy the characters if you want them, and, uh, yeah, just, just own them. Um, like I said, I plan to buy, uh, I bought all the Demogorgon skins, I plan to buy the Nancy and Steve skins in the future, uh, before they, you know, are out of the game completely. Um, <laughs> so I'll probably end up doing that later on. Um, but yeah, so I think for the next couple videos... Um, we might be doing some Hag and Demogorgon videos just to, you know, kind of fuck around and have fun and, you know, enjoy the killer. And, uh, I don't really play much Demogorgon. Uh, I ha- I have played Demogorgon since his rework, and I have to say Demogorgon is fucking insane since his rework. Um, this killer is so fun. Um, not fun enough to make me quit Hag, though, or quit Hag, though, but he's pretty fun. That was good. I'm gonna slug her because I think she is decisive. But, um, yeah, so, uh, you guys will notice there's like a, you know, we're gonna have some sad music and rain effects on the screen. Um, I mean, it, it is kind of a sad day for DVD. Um, you know, this is a pretty big chapter that's leaving, but it's understandable. Again, Netflix has wanted to make their own game for a very long time. <coughs> and you can't have your own game with Dead by Daylight always overshadowing it. So, I understand why Netflix is doing what they're doing. Um, I may not agree with it. And I know a lot of people may not agree with it. Um, I think it's important to not blame Netflix or the developers. Because at the end of the day, <laughs> Netflix is all about money. Right? And so is behavior. And, you know, we can only speculate. 
as to what happened, but I personally believe it's because Netflix wants to step into making their own games, and I think, you know, I think having Stranger Things in a competitive game is a dangerous thing for Netflix, especially if they want to make a game that's similar to DVD and competing against it. It's not a good idea. Um, so, and again, this is all based off of assumption that that's what is happening in the background. Again, we don't know for sure. So, <laughs> um, yeah, we're just gonna kind of enjoy some Demogorgon for the next couple days, uh, as well as, like, hag, you know, hag gameplay. Um, I do have a new intro. Um, well, not really new, but it is kind of updated. I hope you guys like it. And, uh, yeah. Uh, and also, if you guys do like Demogorgon, and want to see more Demogorgon on this channel, make sure to smash that like button, hit that subscribe button, and make sure to comment saying, hey monster, we want to see more Demogorgon. I I'm down to play him. I actually do love Demogorgon as much as I love Hag. Um, I just don't play him very often because MMR, or well, I haven't played him often because of MMR. Um, so I'll, I'll, I'm probably going to start playing him more often now that, you know, he's kind of an exclusive character and shit. And I kind of want newer players to still be able to feel what it feels like to play against Demogorgon. So, I, I'm definitely going to keep playing him, and, uh, yeah, I hope others will too. I, uh, I hope others will still enjoy Demogorgon for what he is. Uh, I think he's an ex just an extremely fun killer. I would argue he's probably just overall really well-rounded, especially for a DLC character. He's very, very balanced and fun to play. So, yeah, <laughs> um, I do want to talk about this because this is something else I saw people posting about on the forums and on Twitter and stuff, a lot of people were asking, is it possible for Demogorgon or the license to ever come back to DVD? And the answer is absolutely yes. Um, and, and I know this for 100% for certainty because what it seems like <laughs> is right now negotiations did not go through for another contract and unfortunately they fell through and things just didn't work out. But that doesn't mean that the game, or that doesn't mean that the Stranger Things chapter is completely gone forever. There is a chance that they can renew it. And again, knowing behavior, there will be probably, they'll probably end up being able to renew it in the future. I will say this, a lot of people are talking about they think this hurts behavior more than it does Netflix. I honestly disagree. I think this decision hurts Netflix more than behavior. Uh, the biggest reason why is Netflix is no longer getting the passive income from behavior, right? For the licensing and for you know the skins and all that they're not they're not they're not getting that anymore right <coughs> also um this is also speculation to when the contract ends but i believe that no november 17th is the end of the stranger things contract i think that's why behavior is giving us ample time uh or ample warning that the contract is pretty much over on november 17th so I, I, if I had to take a wild guess, I think that's expiration date of the contract that was signed. And I'm guessing Netflix has made it very clear they're not re-signing. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> like I said, um, if you haven't, if you really like some skins for Demogorgon, or if you really like some skins for Nancy or Steve, make sure to snag them up while you can. Again, I snagged up all the Demogorgon skins. I do plan on getting all the Nancy and Steve skins at a later date before the deadline ends. Uh, I recommend that you definitely get this stuff. If you haven't purchased the chapter, purchase the chapter now. Because trust me when I tell you, this is, yeah, like, who knows if this, who knows if Stranger Things will ever come back to DVD. So the best thing you can do now is, especially if you're a new player uh, and you may not like Demogorgon or Steve or Nancy, still purchase the chapter because you never know what's, you, you, you just don't want to miss out, right? You don't want to have the opportunity to get something and then just kind of, blow it off like it's nothing and then later on regret not being able to get it a perfect example of stuff like this is legacy a lot of people blew off legacy didn't give a shit about it and then legacy stopped being a thing or stopped being obtainable and then everybody wanted legacy so again uh, i i'm not saying the stranger things chapter is legacy i mean it kind of is at this point because you know you can't get it after november 17th but still, you definitely want to pick up uh, any of the skins that you want. I got Cumagorgon. Uh, <laughs> if you don't know what skin that is, I'm sure you'll find out. Uh, I've got this uh, skin that I'm using now, which I think looks sick as fuck. And I got the um, Chains one. Uh, I already had Prestige, so you know I don't really have to worry about prestiging him. Uh, that's another thing. Um, you know, if you haven't, I'm going to le link down below Behavior's Twitter or the Twitter post. Uh, go and read it. Um, it, they, they explain a lot of stuff in there. 
And I think it's important to read that because uh, a lot of that stuff is um, a lot of that stuff is need to know. <laughs> so if you haven't, definitely go read that. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna miss Demogorgon, man. Or not Demogorgon. Uh, I'm gonna miss Hawkins a little bit. Uh, I know a lot of people. I know I said earlier in the video is Hawkins leaving really a bad thing. Um, the aesthetic of Hawkins is still cool, and I do hate that it's being taken out of the game. But there's not much we can do. And uh, yeah, if you guys did enjoy, make sure to leave a like, share, and subscribe. We're on the road to 100 subs. I'm going to politely ask these guys in the video if I can use this for YouTube. And uh, again, I love you guys. Be safe. Much love. I will catch you guys in the next video, and enjoy the rest of in-game chat. Peace.